Hey friends. Being locked inside of my apartment because of this weird ass storm, I have had the chance for a lot of introspection. So I was watching Secondhand Lions, sorry, Haley Joel Osment, who did not grow up well. And this thought just occurred to me. It also happens to be relevant because seniors are graduating soon. It sort of made me reconsider my life choices. I'm in college, I'm getting a degree. I would love to have a more adventurous life. I have these fantasies where I drop out of college and I just move to Europe and backpack across Europe and secretly become the Princess of Monaco overnight. And then I just write stories about my life and become a millionaire, but I don't need my millions because I'm already the Princess of Monaco. Just normal fantasies, stuff everyone thinks about. But obviously right now, being in school and getting a degree and then getting a job after that those things are a little more important to me right now. And that's okay. It's in all essentiality what I have decided to do with my life. I find that the answer of what do you want to do with your life changes a lot over the course of your life. For example, when I was a kid, I wanted to be several things. I wanted to be a coal miner. I thought it was really cool that they got to ride around in those carts all the time and have like a little pickaxe. I wanted to be a marine biologist, but I had sort of a traumatic experience in the ocean. I was, I was power snorkeling and when I came up for air, my dad told me that an anaconda had been swimming behind me. So thanks dad, thank you for that. I could have lived my life in peaceful ignorance. Now I have nightmares about it. I don't know if it was an anaconda. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It was quite, like some kind of sea snake, but it was a snake and it was, it came after me. And then several other things after that. And somewhere in there, I decided that I wanted to be a writer. So that's where I'm at, basically. But the what I want to do with my life doesn't necessarily have to do with a career. It's what I want my life to be. But the point of this wasn't for me to end this video by saying, achieve your dreams, follow your heart. Cinco de Mayo, vive la France. The point was to explain to you that there are so many different things that are under the umbrella of what you're gonna do with your life. And I wanted to especially touch on it because of graduating seniors and you're getting out of college and you feel like a total fish out of water. And you're like, the way I'm living is wrong because I don't have a real job. I don't have a real this. I don't have a career. And you feel wrong and you feel lazy and you feel pain. No, if you feel pain, you should go to the hospital. What you're gonna do with your life doesn't have to start right when you get out of college. There's no timeline for achieving exactly what you want to achieve. I think the only thing that you need to focus on in terms of your life is if you feel wrong. If you feel like you are out of place, you don't belong, that's when you need to change something. And so you change something. You change something small. Get a new roommate. You get a new boyfriend, leave, you get a new place, get a new dog. Ooh, don't change your dog. The numbers of animals in the shelter systems are so high right now. Take your dog with you. But change something until you feel right. I'm not, I'm not telling you what to do with your life. And I'm not telling you that you have to not know what you're gonna do with your life. If you wanna be an accountant, if you know right now that you're gonna graduate and you're gonna work at a freaking bank, you know what? More power to you, fella. That's great. Pick a bank that's right for your face and live it. I don't know a lot about accounting. So whether you know what you wanna do or you don't know what you wanna do, just keep on keeping on. Was that really the whole point of this video? I could have just said that in the beginning. Well, this was a really intense conversation. Should we, should we dance it out? Do you think? Just lost my glasses. That is bitter. That is the bad stuff. I do not know how to make coffee, nor will I ever learn.